Thank you, bless your Thank you, bless your Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are changing position. New dimension. Hallelujah. And I want you to believe it because it is done. Hallelujah. We'll quickly take the offering the Bible said you do not come to the presence of the Lord. The Lord said to us, new dimension, glorious hope. It was about this time last year, or the beginning actually, that I was invited to Olive Television. And that's where my sister saw me on the television, the one on the camera, everybody. <laughs> She's always in the camera. And she sent me a test 3 a.m. in the morning. And I called and said, What is it that you saw that you made you that made you write what you wrote on the text? She didn't know the Lord was asking us to come down to London. And another sister called us again. She from because she saw us on the television. I said, Pastor, you should come down to London. That was her first word, and up to today I have not seen her face to face. 
But then we are rounding up everything we're doing in military case to come down to London. But she never gave up. She kept calling and then I said, okay, I'll come. I was ministering at Everlasting Life Radio by that time. And I went down to the studio and after that I went to meet her. And she gave me, um, what do you call it, a card. New Year card, that was August. And she was giving me a New Year card saying Happy New Year in the month of August. Praise God. And early in that morning when I was going to the studio to minister, somebody sent me a test um, asking me what the word is in the book of Exodus. What's the meaning of that word? And when eventually I read it, it was a new beginning. Amen. New Year. That was early in the morning and when I met her in the afternoon, she gave me a card saying Happy New Year. And I looked at the word I read in the Bible, Exodus 12, and what she said to me, what she gave to me. I said, what's the Lord doing? Cutting the whole story short, this time around, we had um, the opportunity to have a, a, a slot in Olive Television for every Saturday, 4 to 5 p.m., blowing the shofar new dimension Amen. hallelujah so when the lord said he will do something like that last year about this time he gave us a radio station praise god Amen. new dimension then Amen. and now he's stepping us up to the television amen. Amen. amen new dimension so you are stepping up tell somebody step up, step up. i'm stepping up Hallelujah. We are stepping up. The church is stepping up. We are marching now. What we are saying, we are not giving, we are not saying, we are not preaching. We are saying, for save the Lord. So, by El Shaddai's grace, we will have this, the first portion by coming Saturday. New dimension. So, we know what we are saying. That's why I say, let my wife come up because. She is a living witness to all these things. And she's been there in the tough time, in the good time. Amen. Praise God. Amen. But the time Hallelujah. we get Hallelujah. gooder and gooder and gooder Amen. and gooder. Amen. Amen. That's my own English. <laughs> Amen. Amen. So why I said I wanted to call my, my brother to take the offering. Why I the Lord led in my heart to do this is to speak to everybody here. We are stepping up. Yeah. And you know that going on television for one hour yes. is not, um, what do you call it? It's not buying a biscuit for a child. But you see, we are not looking at ourselves. We are looking at great El Shaddai. And the Lord said to us, it is time that the trumpet will start to sound in all nations. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And we've got, we start to get representatives from every nation. Oh, yes. We've got Bulgaria. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. We've got Latvia. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. We've got, when I went there, I met Congo. Thank you. We've got Zambia. Russia. We've got Russia. Amen. We've got South Africa. We got so, um, most of them in Ghana, Nigeria, Trinidad and Tobago. Amen. Praise God. Jamaica, Jamaica Guyana, Guyana, Guyana United, United Kingdom, Kingdom Sierra Leone, Amen. name it. Amen. The same day, the trumpet will be sounding. You see, what the Lord is doing, you are all part of it. This is not what I alone can do. Amen. This is what we can join our hands together. And what the Lord said, it's not a one-man show on the television. No. It's just like how we come and prophesy. Thank you. Thank you. So in one week, maybe you, 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 you. Five ministers. Praise God. The next week, another five ministers. The next week, 
another five minutes. So everybody here, you get ready. Amen. Amen. The Lord is taking us beyond what the eyes of man can see. But has he said the word? Yes. Has he done it? Yes. Is it finished? Yes. It's already finished. When the Lord said we should come to London, we know nobody. And the Lord opened the door and I was invited to Olive and I got to know her. And from her, I got to know all of you. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When the Lord sends you, he will show you. And he has sent us to London to call down the rain. London will again be the hub of evangelism, salvation, Amen. and the export of Christianity and the gospel again. Amen. Whether the government likes it now or not, it is happening. Amen. One day, you and I will stand at the parliament yes. of United Kingdom yes. and blow the chauffeur. Yes. Acknowledges this and it happens. That land will blossom, the economy will blossom, everything in that country will start to blossom, and that will provoke other nations to jealousy. And finally, Israel of the Most High. Hallelujah! So, this offering we are taking, we we'll call it offering. But I want you to sow a seed to that television ministry. If you don't have, if you have, because I know many did not prepare for it. I want to challenge your faith. I want you to, my brother, I think, where is he? He's gone. He said he's praying he will be the first person that will sow one million seed into this ministry. It's done. Because he has come and he has seen something. Yes. And he desired to be the first person. Amen. Maybe I'll be the first first person. <laughs> so I want you to pray that the Lord will empower you. Amen. That you are not even coming up to say, okay, I'm paying for one month. I'm paying for the whole year. Amen. And the Lord has not asked us to start to rent television stations. The Lord said, we shall own oh, yes. television stations. He gave us radio outfit free of charge. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. He did it. And I know that the television station, <laughs> the springs of life-giving water ministries, the dwelling place of El Shaddai, where the church of God himself we gather day and night praising him in his temple as it is written. Yes. It's not the place where we call people to sow one million pounds and get salvation. No. <laughs> it's a place where prayer will go up 24 7. The house of prayer for all nations. I'm telling you, you are a witness. Shall the dry bone live? Yes. We are prophesying into this mission. Yes. And this is what we are here for. Because that is you. Amen. So that is the offering. You go, you prepare in your heart. Ask the Lord what he will do. Build his house. Yes. Because very soon we will start this week by Exodus Grace. We will pray for the land. We will pray for the church. We will pray for the people. And you, you, and you, and you will be remembered as men 
was remembered. Amen. In your house shall the miracles be happening. Amen. It happened in the house of Mary and Martha. And all the vicinity, all the people came to the house of Mary and Martha to see the one that died and came back to life. Your house will be called the house of miracles. The house of resurrection. The house of miracles, signs and wonders. Remember these brothers and sisters, the miracle did not happen where Mary poured the oil and used her hair to wipe the feet. It happened in Mary's house. So where you pour the oil is where you ignite the miracle. Where the miracle happens is in your house. Amen. Hallelujah. And we are looking for 24, 24 intercessors. 24 intercessors that we say, I belong to the Lord and we pray one hour a day. Amen. One hour every day. One hour every day. We have all your details. Praise God. Hallelujah. And we'll get to you as the Lord lays in your heart. As we round up with this, that's why I say I want to do this by myself. So whatever you have now, you can put at the offering. Whatever the Lord lays in your heart, give me a call. Hallelujah. And we will take it there. And eventually we get all of us to sit together and then see how we run this mission. May the Lord bless you indeed. Amen. And I thank God for my dear wife. Praise God. He is, she is a prophetess and she's always praying for you. I'll ask her to lead us in closing prayer as we take the offering, whatever you have. As she is prophesying, I want you to come up and put, put your offering. But the seed for the television, the Lord will lay in your heart what to do. I pray that you will be the person that will buy that television outfit. And the Lord will do it. I am praying to you. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we thank you for what you have done today. We thank you for the miracle of today. We thank you for the blessing of today. Uh, I pray, pray this blessing upon you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I pray that the Lord will shine his face upon you. The Lord El Shaddai will show you his salvation. I pray and I prophesy this blessing upon you that the Lord we show you kindness. Amen. That the Lord we grant all that all your heart desire in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I prophesy that the face of the Lord shall be seen over you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I prophesy that the Lord El Shaddai shall give you shalom, boldness in everything that you do in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I prophesy that every dry area in your life receive the rain of heaven in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every dry land in your life receive the dew of heaven in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I prophesy that you shall prosper in all your ways in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Christ, I prophesy that the praise of El Shaddai, Elohim Adonai, shall not depart from your mouth in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I prophesy in your life, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, that you shall have uncommon favor, uncommon favor, unmerited favor, this week in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I prophesy that no weapon fashion and formed against you that shall prosper. Every tongue that rise against you judgment shall be condemned in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I prophesy over your life that you shall excel in the mighty name of Yeshua. You shall excel in your education. You shall excel in your marriage. Excel in your business. Excel in your ministry. Whatever you do shall prosper in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. 
Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom, the power, the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Hallelujah. You are welcome in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You are welcome. Return home with your blessings. Return home with your favor. Return home with the good things that the Lord has endured you. With the, with the prayer, especially the anointing. The anointing that the Lord has released upon you. Go and multiply and increase in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Shalom. Shalom.